I just know I got into mode and I needed to save my family. And that family was, at that time, everybody in that room. It was a battlefield Richard Fierro couldn't have imagined. A beloved club where he came with his wife, daughter, her boyfriend and friends for a drag show. But when the first bullets started flying, the 15-year Army vet who served four combat tours in Iraq and Afghanistan felt his instincts kick in. It's the reflex. Go. Go to the fire. Stop the action. Stop the activity. Don't let no one get hurt. Charging through the chaos, Fierro said he tackled a gunman who was wearing full body armor, knocking a rifle out of his hands, then wrestling away a handgun, using it to beat the shooter. He says he even enlisted the help of a drag performer at the club. I told her, kick this guy, kick this guy. And she took her high heel and stuffed it in his face. But Fierro wasn't able to save his daughter's 22-year-old boyfriend, Raymond Green Vance, who died in the attack. He's a good kid, man, and I loved him. I have never encountered a person who had engaged in such heroic actions that was so humble about it. The accused 22-year-old gunman has been arrested on five counts of first-degree murder, as well as several hate-related charges. We're also learning more about the other lives cut short in Saturday night's senseless shooting, five in all. Kelly Loving, a 40-year-old trans woman, is described by a friend as compassionate, generous, and trusting. Derek Rump and Daniel Aston were beloved bartenders at Club Q. It's just a nightmare that you can't wake up from. Ashley Paul leaves behind a husband and an 11-year-old daughter. Her sister, Stephanie Clark, telling NBC News their family is devastated. Ed Sanders, one of 17 people wounded in the attack, grateful to be alive. I want people to show some love to the LGBT people. We deserve the respect and the love like anyone does. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.